Another question we get asked often is, why is my caster fluttering or shaking when we try to move it around the plan? My name is Doug Backinger, and today I'll answer that question. So caster flutter is a common problem in the industry, and really what causes it is you have to look at the caster as kind of a complete system, and you have different forces being applied to this system. And when the caster starts to flutter or shake, what's happening is the, the caster has hit some sort of resonant frequency. So the way we go about combating that and stopping caster flutter is basically just trying to take the caster out of that resonance. And there are a few different ways you can do that. So the first one that we start with is the swivel section. So is it well manufactured? You know, is it um, not really sloppy? Um, you know, it's built tight. Um, that's, that's the first thing we look at. The second thing is the swivel lead. So if your swivel lead is shorter, it is easier for that caster to enter that resonant frequency and start to flutter. So if we have room, what we'll do is we'll increase that swivel lead out and that will greatly reduce the amount of flutter. The third thing that we'll look at is overall mass of the wheel. So you can change that resonant frequency by changing the mass of the wheel, either making it lighter or heavier. So if you're experiencing flutter in your caster application, first thing to look at is do I have room to change out the swivel section or increase the swivel lead? And then if you don't, I would look at changing out your wheel to either something heavier or something lighter. I'm Doug Backinger. Thanks for watching.